Hey there. Someone asked me to make a post about why it's so much harder to walk uphill than on level terrain. So today I'm hiking in the mountains of Northern Vermont in my hometown, and I thought I would make exactly that post. Why is it harder to walk uphill? Well, every time you walk uphill, every step you take, you're working against gravity. So you need to do extra work. And by working against gravity, you're sort of storing energy in your body like a battery and it's stored as gravitational potential energy. So what does that mean? So if I have a hammer sitting on a table next to a nail, it would be difficult for that hammer to drive in the nail. But as soon as I lift that hammer up a couple of inches, I've added some energy to it. I've done some work. I've added some gravitational potential energy to the hammer, and now it's ready to drive the nail. Now, if I lift it up higher, I've actually acted as the energy source, and I've given my energy to the hammer in the form of gravitational potential energy. And now it's lifted higher and it has more ability to drive in that nail. The higher you go, the more gravitational energy, potential energy you've stored. Another way to look at it would be taking a spring and stretching that spring out. You're using some of your energy to stretch the spring. So you're adding potential energy to the spring and when you let it go, that energy is recuperated as kinetic energy as the spring swings back into its original shape. So the good news is, since energy isn't created or destroyed, that energy goes somewhere. And when I take another trail on the way down, walking downhill, I've got all that potential energy stored up. And it's much easier for me to walk downhill since I'm not working against the force of gravity. So for now, all those uphill footsteps were worthwhile. I'm here at Butler Lodge on the side of Mount Mansfield. Nice view. I love Vermont. I love science. Have a great day.